All right, everybody, it's Brandon again, back with another Chrome OS Flex video. And um, I'm here on my MacBook Air. It's a 2015 Core i7 MacBook Air. And on the dev channel, has recently been updated to Chrome OS Flex 105. Now, this actually happened almost a week ago. But unfortunately, I had the COVID-19 thing. And uh, I just felt so bad I couldn't get up to do a Chrome OS Flex video. So sorry for the delay on the information on this. I am feeling a little better, so uh, that's why I'm recording the video today. <clears throat> so as you can see here, we're on uh, Chrome OS Flex version 105. And just to let everybody know, for most people now trying to use Chrome OS Flex, I would uh, recommend the Stable branch, which is on uh, version 103 still, but it works really good. There's not a whole lot of new features from 104 and 105 that uh, are so compelling that you'd need to get back onto the dev channel. So I recommend Stable for most people now. But if you like to see what's new, uh, 105 is available on the dev channel. And um, here's a couple things new that I've discovered, and there's probably more, and you can let me know in the comments if you found more. Uh, so let me close out of this. One of the first things, if you uh, right click on your desktop and go to set wallpaper and style now, <clears throat> this screen has kind of changed. There's a, uh, they now have a screensaver option. I didn't know if there was a screensaver before in Chrome OS Flex, but uh, there definitely is now, which you could turn on here. I don't have it on. But also, uh, you can now switch the theme pretty easily between light, dark, and auto. And I think auto turns it to dark mode uh, during the nighttime. I'm not 100% sure on that, but I think that's what that does. Uh, personally, I kind of think the light looks better. But it is cool that you can now easily switch between light and dark mode. And there is another new feature I have not tested yet. I'm going to test it right here, not right now on the video. And that is apparently a new flag for a new feature they're working on called uh, Partial Split, which is kind of like a uh, window managing thing I, that I think is kind of like the snap feature on Windows. So let me go to Chrome, Flags, and see if I can find it here. Split. Okay, Partial Split. Enables the option to snap windows into two-thirds and one-third split view. So uh, let's go ahead and see what that does. It's enabled that. What's this other one? If enabled, windows will be moved. And, okay, I don't need that. So we'll go ahead and do a quick restart there. The reason I'm able to record while restarting is because I'm uh, recording my screen with a video capture device. And so now let's uh, go ahead and open a window. Let's go to Files. And I don't know how this works. Apparently, I mean, I saw some screenshots of it. I should have tested. This is one of those things I should have tested before I started recording. But I never do that. How's this supposed to work? Maybe it doesn't do anything yet. I saw screenshots of this on... Uh, online that kind of made it look like the windows uh thing where you get an option to um where you can change your split setup but i don't see it actually doing anything here let me search chrome os partial split now this is interesting you guys saw me switch it to light theme but uh obviously my browser is on a dark theme here could be a bug with version 105. let's see chrome os could let you split your screen in different ways. Well, I don't know. Anyway, maybe it doesn't work yet. I'm sorry for that. Sorry for wasting your time on that. <laughs> that is a new flag that's here in Chrome OS Flex. So anyway, other than that, I have not seen a whole lot new. I've only played with this for about 10 minutes here. There might be some other stuff, there might not. A lot of the things you might notice that are different from yours are uh, just flags that I have turned on. Like, um, I got this split view here so I can have the nice looking calendar. I have the nice notifications turned on. These are all things you can find in Chrome OS flags that they're not specific to Chrome OS Flex version 105. And so I'll keep playing around with this, and if I find other new things, I'll let you guys know. And if you guys know of anything new in version 105, you can let us all know in the comments. Uh, but this is Chrome OS Flex 105. Again, if you are using Chrome OS Flex, in my opinion, 
At this point, you're better off staying on the stable channel, which is Crobos Flex 103. It works really good. It has all the features you need. The only reason I'd even try uh, beta or dev at this point is if your particular hardware has something that doesn't work. I know on a lot of laptops, like the SD card doesn't work properly. I think it does work on this MacBook. I have an Asus laptop where my SD cards never worked. I haven't tried it on Flex yet. I actually put Windows back on that laptop. That's a story for a different video. So anyway, Dev Channel 105, it's been out for a little under a week now. Sorry I didn't get to it sooner, but I haven't been feeling good. But I'm feeling better now, so expect more videos to come on the channel. Thank you guys for watching, and uh, I hope you all have a good day. Bye now.